Uh, a bit louder. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I think someone put it really well. It was one of my old directors and he said, jump higher because not many humans can fly. It's this wonderful, magical, almost cosmic, like it, it's, it just, everything feels right when I'm dancing. I love storytelling. That then translates into dance when we're doing, when we're dancing, we're then telling a story. I feel like there was like no definitive time where I felt like I was gonna be a dancer. I felt like I was one of those kids, I was like born for it. Being able to release and feel everything and express and having that live audience, like there's nothing like it. Dancing is what I started off doing and it's my first love. When you're in that flow, in that state of um, joy, it's just so infectious to watch. I feel like every extre all my extremities have power and I have this source of power inside me that I just am shooting out. When I'm dancing, I feel free. I feel open and big and vibrant. I'm getting applause, I'm getting people smiling, then that's, that's why, that's why you do it. For me there was never anything else. Um, it was just, there was nothing ever that ever came close to the feeling that I got from being on stage. There have been life events or moments in my life that I've missed and had to sacrifice. You miss the weddings, you miss the funerals, you miss the birthday parties, you miss um, the births of people. You know, I, I've only been in a show or two and I've already missed all four. When you hit rock bottom and they're the ones that pull you up, your family, your partners, your very dear friends, they're the ones that are there for you. To not be able to repay them back for that is heartbreaking. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> um, yeah, sorry. <laughs> There is a lot of sacrifice with your family and there's a lot of sacrifice with your body. If you're like an athlete, but with athletes, they get the downtime, they get the rehab, they... It's, I think it's harder to be a performer. That's like the one thing that gets me down about dancing is just that I, I'm in pain a lot of the time. And then, so when you're not dancing, you're working to rid that pain. There's absolutely, there's pain. There's always pain, but it's, it's worth it. That it's worth it. It is definitely worth it, 100%. I think it was my very first show I went to was a chorus line and I, th I must have been about 10 or 11 and I remember just being blown away by the dancing. I think that's what's special about a chorus line is that it's for dancers by dancers. It's literally what we go through, like it's a tiny little snippet of what we actually go through. There's no other show that shows how the, the performer is actually feeling. It's our story, it's getting to share our, is using our own journey and our own experiences into performing this. It's so raw, it's so powerful, and it's really, yeah, just absolutely dance. What will it feel like to be an audience member? What, what do you think is gonna hit you? Oh, sweat, 100% sweat. <laughs> energy, just energy and enthusiasm and emotions from everyone. And the sweat and the heat and the desperation, um, I think yeah, tangible, very tangible, very real. It's not, we're not, you know, you're not in the dress circle in a huge theatre, you're in it, you're part of the show. I want them to see the stress, the joy, the fear, the sadness, you know, maybe we are sharing more about our personal lives than we ever have before and and the audience are going to get to witness that. I think it's, this is going to be really special. And I hope that with this version of the show and these incredible people, we get to inspire another generation of performers to do the same. <laughs>